the doctor back in the summertime and he said, oh, you need prednisone for your drop leg syndrome and for your headaches. And you need to take something else, some other kind of drug. You take a shot, it's called Tocibri. Well, I looked online and did some research on Tocibri and they took it off the shelf, the FDA, because it wasn't approved anymore. So when I called him in the summertime and I told him that, he said, yeah, only eight people got a, um, they received, they got an infection. Only seven people out of 38,000. And those are the one that was reported. Could be more, but it doesn't matter how many people. But if it happens to you, that's the most important thing. So your question is about the prednisone. What is the what is prednisone? Prednisone is a synthetic corticosteroid that is man-made to reproduce the cortisol that the that the adrenal gland produce. Okay, it's probably at the turn of the uh, 19th century. It was a miracle drug. It works. It's very important as part of medicine for people who have problems, but temporarily it becomes a problem when you have to not take the steroid on a regular basis because it's going to shut down your own adrenal to produce the cortisol. So that's what they always tell you when you take steroid, you have to wean yourself off so that you don't go into an adrenal crisis because your body gets used to it and then from the moment you stop it, what happens is your body don't produce it anymore and then you go in shock, okay? So prednisone is very useful temporarily. People who have poison IV and they're covered and it's very uncomfortable or severe skin problem until we find out what the problems are, it's okay. 